Hey, Fiddler's Elbow, Coach Shannon here from the Bridge Fitness Center, bringing you a few tips on some hip mobility work. We all sit way too much, sit in the car, we sit in traffic, you're sitting at your desk, we sit on our commuting trip to work. We need to work those hips. That will help out with that low back pain, probably even some knee pain, but it's gonna make your body feel a lot better. So I'm gonna do um, three different exercises, uh, one standing, one sitting, and one in sort of like a half kneeling position. I'm gonna start out, I got my little golf club here just for a little assistance, you can use anything, a staircase, a wall, a couch, but I am just going to go ahead and swing my legs as hard as I can or as really as far as I can with range of motion. So I'm gonna swing them forward and backwards and I'm gonna do that five to six times forward and backwards and then I'm gonna go sideways. So I kind of wanna go in two planes of motion. So forward and backwards is sagittal and this is the frontal plane, right? So I'm really feeling my standing leg working and then I'm opening up sort of that hip flexor. I'm opening up, this is a hip flexor when I bring my leg up and I swing it back and I'm gonna squeeze my glutes and I'm really going to go ahead and just make my legs feel nice and warm, right? We just really wanna get some range of motion. Again, get that blood flowing, get the circulation going. So that is your sort of standing hip mobilization exercise. Now I'm gonna sit. So one of my favorite positions is the pigeon pose. This is a variation on the pigeon. So many of us can, and hopefully you can try, to cross your right ankle on your left knee, right? So this is a figure four position. I'm gonna take that elbow, and I'm just gonna gently push into sort of my knee, and I'm gonna lean forward. I'm not gonna bend at my spine. I'm just going to hinge forward, lean my chest forward, and I'm really feeling some great like stretching in my hamstrings and my rear glute. So I'm gonna kind of work on that, maybe about 30 seconds on one side, and I'm gonna go to the other side, same thing. So I'm pushing down on that knee, just very gently. I'm holding, you can hold your foot, so that your foot, your, your, your knee, sort of your leg, almost comes into like this figure four uh, right in front of you, right? So again, that variation on the pigeon pose. And then the last one I'm going to do is, so you can do this in a half kneeling position from like on the floor, on the pillow, something but I'm gonna do it sort of half standing so I've got this bench right and I've got a little yoga block so this is called a very it's a variation on the great stretch so what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna try to come down and bring my armpit right parallel with my kneecap so I'm gonna try and reach my forearm towards this bench and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up really wide and I'm gonna look for those fingers, right? So what I'm doing is I'm really stretching those glutes, stretching that hip, I'm loading into that hip as I reach up to the sky and look at my fingers. And then again, I'm gonna come down. So I'm getting a little inner thigh here and some rear hip as well. So I'm gonna do this about five times on each side. Now again, you could do this on the floor, you could do the same thing with your yoga block and reach up but if you have a bench or some kind of, you know, maybe like a low couch or something and you wanna put your foot up there, go ahead and do it. It might make it a little bit easier. So those three exercises, again, they're not gonna take you more than five minutes to do. You can do it in a commercial. You can do it, you know, while you're um, getting ready for work in the morning. There's a lot of time that we can fill little pockets where we have moments to just work on our mobility. You are gonna feel better and I hope to see you soon. I am here in the gym if you need anything. Thanks.